Welcome back to the channel guys welcome back to the another video in today's video I'm going to talk about iOS 26 public beta 5 as the update is out and most probably this is going to be the last public beta and next week we are expecting an RC update now if I talk about the uh, bill number over here the bill number is going into the about section it is 23A533ZO I don't know it's O no it's 0 it's 0A and now there is A at the end of the bill number which means most probably this is going to be the last um, beta and next week we are expecting the RC update and we saw one thing in the previous public beta 4 then there was nothing much of changes it was a small update with small enhancements and all that and other improvements were there and same is this update there is not big noticeable features this is a small update but still if i want to talk about what is new in this update now what i'm able to find is two different things over here now this is the latest public beta 5 this is the previous beta over here public beta 4 and i notice a small difference in the dock now over here the public beta 4 public beta 5 it feels this is a glassy dock as you can see i'm not sure if the camera is doing justice and over here it's a slight difference in the dock also it feels there's a slight difference in the icon size now if you see over here the um, padding of icons between each other and it feels there's a slight difference maybe it is because of a different iphone i'm not sure but it feels it is like slight frosted and a slight difference in the dock and I, there are more people who are talking about that there is actually a difference in the dock also one thing i noticed that when i open the messages app or any app that is on number two over here it comes from this corner it the animation opens from this corner like this as you can see but with the public beta 5 it comes from the bottom exactly from the bottom it is not coming from the corner it is coming from the bottom again i'm not sure if you're able to see the difference on the camera but there is definitely difference in the animation so far i'm able to find these two changes i dig into the um software but i am not able to find any change so far but these are two changes that i'm able to find it which means this update is more about enhancements more about improvement and it also feels that pretty much whatever apple wanted to you know release with the uh, wwdc ui wise is out and next week as i saw we are expecting the rc update now if i talk about the battery life many people were complaining that beta 4 battery life public beta 4 battery life is not as good as was public beta 3 and i also noticed that public beta 3 battery life was really really good public beta 4 was not that good but over here i'm expecting a much better battery life but definitely it is out now i will be test out overall device i'm like i'm gonna go do a real world test and you know test it properly and after 24 hours i will be coming up with a couple of more videos in which i will able to talk about the battery life but for now i cannot talk about the battery life but one thing that i can definitely talk about is the geekman score so i ran the test on the iphone 11 over here I got 1765 on a single core and 319 on a multi core. A single core is higher than the average one, multi core is also higher than the average one. And but however, it is like slightly lower than the previous beta, as you can see. Slightly lower, but not a big difference. In the GPU score, if I go over here, it is like 13865 metal score, which is higher than the average one but again it is slightly lower than the previous public beta um it's just out it's just initial impression i hope this will get better after using it for a couple of days um this is what i'm expecting so far i talk about what is new with this update and also talk about the battery life i also shared the geek quest score next week we are expecting rc update that is going to be on hopefully on 1st of september then the second week of september we are actually expecting the public release of ios 26 so what you guys are expecting and which ios version you guys are using are you still on ios 18 or you are on ios 26 let me know in the comment section below 
and I'm also seeing that many people are not subscribing to the channel they are just coming over here watching the stuff getting to know about the stuff but they are not subscribing so guys come on make sure to subscribe hit the bell icon over here I am doing a lot of you know videos for you guys so you can um, I'm like I'm trying to help you guys in every possible way so yeah this is all from this iOS 26 public beta 5 video if you have any query let me know in the comment section below and I hope to catch you guys in my next video until that take care Peace out.